Hey, welcome to this short mini sewed series. I am making these to invite you to cruise with me and my husband, Sean, on a fabulous seven night Seine River cruise through the country of France. It is going to be amazing. These episodes are giving you a little sneak peek into some background and some areas that we're going to be visiting, including the beaches of Normandy, which is the site of the D-Day invasion in World War II, um, the town of Giverny, which is the place where the Impressionist artist Monet lived and painted, and the town of Rouen, which is a really amazing historic and medieval city that is along the Seine River. So there's other places and other details. And if you would like more information, please check out the show notes and we would love to have you join us. Hi, welcome to Sweet Dreams Wellness Travel. I am Barbara Tuckett, your host and the owner of Sweet Dreams Travel. I am a wellness travel specialist. I believe that our mind, body, and spirit all play into our well-being, and I create travel experiences which improve your wellness so that you return from your vacation with more health, more happiness, and more connection, both with those you've traveled with and also with your destination. In these episodes, I explore travel and wellness experiences, giving you ideas and recommendations, and also interviewing people who have first-hand experience of the places where you may want to go next. Welcome, let's get started. Hello, I'm happy to have you with me today. Today is going to be another kind of short episode because we are going to highlight another destination for our French river cruise that is coming up. This is, this location that we're going to talk about today is called Caudebec en Co. And it is the home of the first waterproof hat. Caudebec en Co. is famous for the first waterproof hat being invented here. This is a really small little French town on the Seine River. And Caudebec, if you look it up, the definition literally means a rain hat made from lamb's wool or camel hair. So the name came from this invention that was invented here. Caudebec's industries historically included tanning and leather making. So it's pretty obvious why the first waterproof hat was invented here. So today, the most famous landmark in Caudebec, which is the, the entire name is Caudebec en Co, but they shorten it and they just call it Caudebec for short. So the most famous landmark today is a Notre Dame Cathedral that is located here. It is beautiful. Um, we will have opportunities on this river cruise to see this amazing cathedral and to explore the area around this, this city of Caudebec. The really cool thing about Caudebec is for this river cruise, we get to make an overnight stop here. And you will see besides just this cathedral and learning about the history of the first waterproof hat, there is so much more in the area to see and visit and discover. So I'm gonna talk about a few of the areas and the excursions that are available. So on my river cruise, which this um, cruise that I'm talking about is one that I am going on and that you are invited on, more about that later. On this river cruise, I might choose to take the scenic biking tour from Rouen, which is the city that we'll be in right before that, to Caudebec, rather than board the ship to make the journey. So there will be two options. I can either take a bike or I can stay on the ship, get on the ship and go float down the river to get to Caudebec. So that is one cool option. Um, another option for a an excursion is a place called the Chateau de Telan. And this chateau is famous because it is the first Italian Renaissance chateau, which chateau, which was built in France in 1494. There's a wonderful chapel with the original wall paintings that are still on it. 
and there's a guard house which dates back to 1350. So super, super old architecture around here. And the chapel that is here um, at this chateau is known as one of the loveliest ones in the Seine Valley. So it's really got a good reputation. And so this would be a really fun, the Chateau de Telan would be a really fun one to go visit. But that is not all. There is the town of Bayeux, which is located close by. And this is another excursion that maybe I'll take. Um, Bayeux is also a medieval city and it has a, a really cool city center. Um, there is a world-renowned tapestry here that is called the Bayou Tapestry, and it depicts in the year 1066, the year that, that the Norman invasion came to England. So the tapestry is still there in the cathedral, and um, Bayou is really a fun town and place to visit. Okay, that is not all in the area of Catabook. Um, there is the town of Cayenne, and you can take an excursion here. This is one of the really small, fun little towns, and they have a site here that is called the Chateau de Cayenne, which is an 11th century castle built by William the Conqueror. And another excursion option with, is what's called the Harcourt Arboretum. And this is 30 acres and nearly 3,000 trees that you can wander through and look at. And the Arboretum is the palatial Chateau du Champ de Bataille. So there is another chateau here at the Arboretum. And also there's a commune uh, that is called Le Bec Eloin and it has an 11th century abbey. So tons and tons of history lots of really cool, fun places to visit um, all along this area um, here in Cadabu en -Co. And um, it's a good thing that we will be there overnight because I can't imagine trying to cram all of this stuff into just like a few hours. So um, my husband, Sean and I are already booked on this river cruise and we would love to have you join us if you would like to. I have some group space that is blocked out. So if anybody wants to join us, um, there are different room categories, different price points available. All of our food, all of our excursions are already included. Um, I will put a link in the show notes to a previous post about another stop that I already highlighted, which is the beaches of Normandy. Just a reminder, in case you are trying to block out your calendar, the River Cruise dates are October 14th through the 21st, and this is in 2023. Please feel free to contact me for more information. And thanks for joining me today as I for this quick little talk about one of the River Cruise areas. Thanks. Thanks for joining me today. If you've enjoyed this episode, please like, share, subscribe, or leave a review. If you'd like to contact me about a vacation, the best way is to visit my website, sweetdreamstravel.net. To connect on social media, you can find me on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, or LinkedIn. See you next time.